What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Damien from Adapt and DNY and today I will show you how I made an exercise stepper with palette. If you are new here, hit the red subscribe button and the bell icon and let's begin. So before we move to the fun part, let me show you how I designed a stepper using SketchUp. The idea is to use remaining material from a past project. I've decided to make two stepper, which I can put one on another to double its height. I've also designed a slider lock to prevent the two stepper to move one together. Check out the link in the description below to download the 3D model of a stepper for free. So let's have a quick view of the different tools and equipment used for this project. Here are the materials that I will use for this project. If you want to know how I bring apart a palette, check out my previous video on the link above. So let's begin. The first thing I need to do is to mark a 45 degree cut on the block for the slider. Then using my table so all blocks are cut. Once all blocks are ready, I can now fix it to the top bolt. To be able to fix the board, I need to mark and cut a bottom support. Once cut, I can now assemble the stepper. And voila! I've set my circular saw at 45 degrees and make a starter cut on my board. Then I've marked the distance between the two blocks and cut along the marking. I need to make sure that the slider slides freely in the blocks. Once all is slider are ready, we can now fix it together. To make sure that the slider is not too loose or tight, I've added a 5mm plywood between the two sliders to make a spacer at the back and screw everything. Then I've used a fastener bit to make a hole through the slider to act like a handle. Before we can use the stepper, I've polished everything with my polishing sander from coarse to fine paper. And yes, we are ready for testing. So guys, this is a project which my wife asked me to do 
during the confinement period due to COVID-19 so that she can still do some exercise. I hope you enjoyed this video and you like it. Hit the like button and subscribe to the channel and make sure to turn on the bell notification to get notified when I post a new video.